To construct an equilateral triangle, go ahead and start a new document. And to that new document, add a graphs and geometry page. You will need to hide the axes and the grid line. To do that, go to Menu, 2 View, 1, Hide Axes. This will hide the axes in the geometry and graphs page. To hide the entry line, you could use Control G or Menu 2 for View. Toggle to the right for 3 to hide the entry line. Next, we want to draw a segment to build our equilateral triangle on. That is under Menu 6 and 5 for Segment. Put a good spot to place your segment on. Click Enter and slowly drag your cursor to the right when you have the segment of the desired length. Press Enter again. Next we'll need to build circles to help us get the lengths for the sides of our equilateral triangle. That is under Menu, 8 for Shapes. 1 is our Circle Tool. Select the Circle Tool. Place the center first and then slowly drag the radius point to the other end of your segment. When it reaches the under point, it turns into a finger. Press Enter. Repeat the process and draw your circle the other way now, starting with the center point and dragging it to the radius point on the other end of the segment. As usual, when complete, press Enter and then press Escape to get out of the circle tool. Next, we want to construct intersection points of this circle. Menu 6 for points and lines. Toggle to the right. We find 3 is where we construct our intersection points. Select that, select one circle, then the other, and the intersection points are constructed for you. Press Escape when complete. Next, we want to construct the sides of the equilateral triangle. Menu, 6. Toggle over to the right and choose Segment. And draw your sides of the equilateral triangle from one end point of your original segment to one of the intersection points, and from that intersection point to the other end of your segment. When complete, press Escape to exit the Segment Drawing tool. Next, we'd like to hide these circles and the uh, remaining intersection point at the bottom. That is uh, under Menu, Tools. Toggle to the right, select number 2, which is Hide and Show. You'll have a little eye with a slash through it. Select both circles and the intersection point at the bottom of the screen and you have your equilateral triangle. Had I planned ahead, I would have labeled my points as I had uh, proceeded through the construction. To do that now, we will go Menu, 1 for Tools, 5 to choose the Text tool. Move the cursor over one point, press Enter, and enter the name of that point. We will label ours A. This one will be labeled B. And the remaining point at the top will be labeled C. Press Escape when you're done labeling your vertices. Move your cursor to the bottom. Control click and let's drag our equilateral triangle the entire page down a little further. And to test that the construction passes our drag test, we will drag vertex B, confirming that it does seem to stay together. 